Welcome to the crucial booth here at Computex 2018. Now there is some new DDR4 memory to discuss. A collaboration between ASUS and Crucial. This is the Tough Gaming series. You got different speeds that are based on the Sports LT series. So they're coming with the Sports AT series, ranging with speeds from 2666 megahertz CL14 all the way up to 3 gigahertz. Now they are using the Micron banks on this particular memory, and the XMP profiles, as with all Crucial products, they generally work in every single motherboard at least that I've tested I've never had a problem in the past with other XMP profiles for instance I have had problems where they just don't work and you're scratching your head so this is a 1.2 volt with the 2666 stuff now it'll only come in a little bit more expensive than the current LT series which you can get on Amazon currently for two 8 gigabyte sticks for $150 now there are other color schemes of course red black and silver being the mains but also with their elite series that is their top of the line memory so if you want to overclock then this stuff is seriously hardcore 3600 megahertz hertz out of the box with CL17 timings. Now the good news about that is that it's at 1.35 volt. When we look at some of the competitors' memory, that is coming in with uh, 1.5, even going up to 1.6 volts, which is extremely high for DDR4 memory. But with all that aside, let's take a look at another new 3D printing feature that has come out recently two months ago with some of Crucial's memory. Two thousand eighteen's Computex coverage wouldn't be possible without Gigabyte or Corsair, bringing you the quality and also the reliability that you need when building a new PC. Welcome back to Tech Yes City. And besides the sport and elite memory, there is one sitting in the middle called the Tactical. Now it has bars on top. Originally coming with RGB light bars, you can actually remove them and then put in your own 3D printed design. And this came out about two months ago. Also for the other stuff, the AT series, the Tough Gaming, that is releasing very soon, so stay tuned for that. But this stuff here, 3D printed module, download the schematics, and if you've got a 3D printer, you can make your own modules up. So simply remove the light bar, make it and then put it in and it's yours with a custom design so on display here they do have their own custom designs which do look quite funky and besides that they are matching color schemes here with a special gigabyte design air and then lastly finishing off the booth here with crucial is their reliable lineup of ssds and also server side memory they are sporting 64 gigabyte registered dims this is the first time i've actually seen one of these in the flesh it does look very expensive and then also on the ssd line there is nothing new coming or so i'm told even in the concept stages and they wouldn't tell me i did try and pick their brains but in terms of rgb memory they are hitting the market following those aesthetics with rgb and even custom designing things yourself and then going in collaboration with azus it seems like azus everywhere they go now they're collaborating on the tough gaming let me know in the comment section below what you think of these products and also the tough gaming stuff as well and i'll catch you guys in another tech video very soon Peace Peace out for now. Bye. No one got hurt. <laughs> so if you download more RAM. No one got hurt. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. No one got hurt. <laughs> uh, dude, like, here we are meeting up again. Do I, Mike? That looks delicious, dude. Like, are you enjoying that? It's about as juicy as your accent right now. Oh yeah, that's a pretty juicy accent, dude, isn't it? Oh, and juicy lamb shank. We don't even have these where we're from. We eat kangaroo. <laughs>